the double hamburger. Is there cheese in hamburger? There's no cheese in hamburger. When you have a cheeseburger, you have a cheeseburger. If you have hamburger, you have hamburger. I want my money back. I want my money back now, and I want it fast. There's not even bacon on this, and not onion on this, and not anything that I asked for. This is such incompetence. I cannot believe it. It happens every time I come here. This, I'm losing my shit because this happened the past three times I've come. Please be competent once in your life. Once. Take an order and fill it. Dang. Imagine being this heated over a hamburger. When you have a cheeseburger, you have a cheeseburger. If you have hamburger, you have hamburger. But like, who doesn't want cheese on their burger? My ass, my beautiful Okay, if you can't eat cheese, like that's one thing, obviously. But like, who just doesn't like cheese? I'm sorry, but what are you doing? I'm just crackers about cheese. Well, you got half of them right, the other half of them wrong. This is the third try to get these burgers right. I am really angry. I got all the way home, and they're still not right. I don't know who is so stupid you can't read English. It's not hard. Okay, I'm hard. really angry, and I'm sorry I'm yelling. Okay. I'm really upset. But you did it once, you did it once. Okay. And they're still wrong. Okay, it's I'm not sorry. hard. This is burgers. This is ketchup, mustard, onion, pickle. You know what? That was handled really well by the people working there. They obviously did not want to be a part of that. They didn't want to see that. This is not what they need right now, but that was handled beautifully. Is this your order? Let me take a look at that. I've got all the way home and back again now. You should get a light and you should cut me because I'm really, really cruel. Sorry, I have to pull down. Yeah. Just yeah. Yo. The fact that this lady, though, straight up went all the way home, she says, I got home. Damn it, rookie mistake. <laughs> then she would have gotten out of her car, go into her kitchen, probably open this thing up, look at it, and instead of literally eating it, to get back in your car and then drive back here, that is a level of commitment that I am just not familiar with. But then I'm sorry. You didn't like the other 22 ounces of it? Mm -hmm, no. So we need to make you a frappuccino? Mm-hmm, yep. That's cute, okay. Please. You need extra caramel drizzle on that too. Extra caramel drizzle, please. It's good customer service. That's what that's what it is. You're just waiting there like that? Like isn't your arm? Thank you. you. You could at least turn around and get it from me. Yeah, there thank, you go. Thank you. Have a great one. You too. Why are you still filming yourself? Hold up. Wait a second. Wait a minute. Before I get into the rest of that, was he biting the top of the cup? Because I did not see a straw in there. He just like, mm. Oh my god, the pretentiousness in that video is just like through the freaking roof. Like standing there filming for however long, just his face waiting for the drink, and then doesn't even have the respect to turn around and grab the drink. He's like, hand it to me, peasant. Like, really? Really? Well, you got half of them right, the other half of them Oh my god. This is the third try to get these burgers right. Oh no, not the burgers. I am really no. angry. I got all the way home. And they're still not right. I don't know who is so stupid you can't read English. It's not hard. I'm really angry, and I'm sorry I'm yelling. Okay. I'm really upset, but you did it once, you did it once. Okay. And you're still wrong. Okay, it's I'm not sorry. hard. This is burgers. This is ketchup, mustard, onion, pickle. This is your order right Yes, now. this is not rocket science. Oh, see, I feel like this is a lesson in checking your order before you leave the parking lot. Because yes, sometimes it's wrong. Sometimes, you know, you don't get what you asked for. But don't be like this person and go all the way home and then check the order. Such a rookie mistake. <laughs> like you get your food, you go through the bag, you make sure everything is right, and if it's not, then you're still there. And then you can go get it fixed. So you're not wasting your gas money and your time. Or you can just suck it up and just eat the food. Like, that is also an option. Holy.
Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Come on, what the hell is that level of craziness? And yo, the fact that, okay, that was dumb, Annie. That was definitely dumb. But like, don't be getting on Annie right now. Like, Annie's not the crazy chick that's smashing sh in your freaking restaurant. Like, I didn't mean to open it. I tried to lock it. Yeah. 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 This is police officer stuff right now. Like, you are going to jail for at least, you know, like several days, lady. Like, that is messed up levels of craziness right now. Could you imagine, guys, literally being in the drive-thru behind that? I am slowly backing up and I am getting out of there, man. I am getting out of that situation. So this is when I worked at Starbucks and this lady, she comes in and she waits all the way again in the line, which I thought was weird. I asked to speak to a supervisor, which was me. And she goes, yeah, my like lid wasn't all the way on my cold brew and it spilled all of my car. So I have to keep coming in and getting napkins. My husband has to come and help me clean my car. And like it got in my hair. I have to get my jacket dry clean. She's going off. And I'm like, I'm so sorry. I'm more than happy to replace your drink. We will refund you your money. Like I do apologize. Um, there's nothing else I can do. You know, like I've done everything that I can. This woman was still not happy. I don't know if she expected us to like go out and help her clean her car, which like, no. You're gonna come in and cause a scene because you spilled your drink in your car on your stuff. Like, that sounds like a you problem. Um, that's your fault. Like you shouldn't have picked it up by the fucking lid. Anyways, so even after all of that, I refunded her money. She got a free drink, all of this stuff. Um, she still emailed my district manager and tried to get me in trouble, even though I had nothing to do with her spilling her drink. Wow. Imagine trying all that because you spilled your own drink. As soon as that, that cup leaves the establishment, they are no longer liable, okay? Yeah, my like lid wasn't all the way on my cold brew and it spilled all in my car. I missed the part where that's my problem. Everything else is on you. So note to self, don't grab your drink by the lid. Oh, Get me the order right now! Ah! Me too. Hey, hey, Call the police. Go. Call the well then, somebody get this man this order. Toddler energy on 10, on 100. Why you're throwing bins everywhere and doing whatever, I don't know. If I could help you, I would. But this stuff does not add enough here. Why does so much energy that you're just expelling? For like what? What was the reason? What was the reason? Oh. Oh my god. Like what? No way. That's crazy. Uh, what could they have possibly done wrong in that scenario to warrant that level of reaction? Like savage, chaotic, lawless. It can't be food related. It has to literally be like, she came, she tried to order her food, and then like the person turned to her and was just like, yeah, like, like, I like just, I, I don't even know. I actually don't even know. I'm sorry, sir, I assume she is broken. Like, I, I don't even know what you would say in that scenario to get to that level of angriness. Like, it does not make any sense to me. Like, you need to calm down, lady. That is too much. Give me my fucking coffee. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and call the cops. Give me my You're not getting your coffee, bro. The guy, the one in the background really didn't have to butt in. Hey, Toby, you suck! But also, the person in the car didn't have to be like that either. Like, I get it. It's like the morning and you want your like morning coffee and you're like super grouchy, but like don't take it out on other people, okay? I don't make the rules. Just calm down and go about your day. If you don't get your morning Starbies, then like the world's not gonna end, okay? You will survive, grab a Red Bull, you'll be fine. What is going on, all of you beautiful, wonderful people of the internet? Welcome back to Top 10 Central. I'm your host for this one, Brie Room, and today we are reacting to people who freaked out over wrong orders. We got the wrong orders of, of cheeseburgers and hamburgers and whatever else people are gonna be 
angry about probably everything under the sun. But before we get into the rest of the videos, make sure you guys are subscribed to the channel, you've got your notification bell on, you left the like on this video, and leave me a comment telling me what you like to order from McDonald's, because I wanna know. Give me something new to try. Chicken strips! So the other day I was working at Starbucks and I was on drive-thru. That was going pretty smoothly, it was not that bad. Not to mention we are mainly getting iced chais, which are the easiest to make. It takes like five seconds to make. I tell my coworker, oh, thank God we're only getting iced chais, right? And then the next guy comes up and he goes, can I get eight hot chais, extra hot, and a whole bunch of other things? Alrighty, so you want a hot chai? No, I want eight hot chais. Not to mention with a whole bunch of extra specifications. I clearly jinxed this one. The person behind them had about eight or nine items. When he gets to the window, he says, I need to talk to the barista that made these drinks now. God. I turned to the barista who made the drinks. They gave me the, because that was super creepy and they didn't want to talk to him. And I said, I'm sorry, they're working on a nine item order. Um, I can relay the message. And he just goes, F you man. And then slams on his gas and drives away. Why? 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 It's a drink! Before, wait, hold up, hold up, hold up. How are you gonna order something extra hot? Can I get eight hot chais extra hot? Because you're not gonna be able to drink it. So you're just gonna like keep the cup in your cup holder and just like look at it longingly? Oh. Oh God, okay. Oh, oh, oh. Oh my. There was no audio, so I don't know what he was yelling about. But this man really said, <laughs> you know you're really heated when you're like, mm. also, was that an aquarium? Now that I'm looking at that, are there fish in there? Is that an aquarium in a restaurant just chilling on the counter? What is it doing there? Why? Get the fish away. The fish don't belong there. I waited, and you served the person after me! I don't want it, I just want my f***ing money back! Oh my god. If you didn't want to wait, you could have just ordered ahead, and then just pick it up in the store. I'm not waiting on a line! There are alternatives. If you know that you are in a rush, or if you're not a very patient person, you just go on the app, and then you type in your order, and you send it through, and then they make it, so you go and pick it up, and leave. Right? Simple as that, I just walked you through the entire process in this video. So next time, don't get so uptight. Order ahead, or just make your own damn coffee. It's not that hard. Why did you do a refund? I asked my manager from, if you order from my owner, you can't do no refund. All we can do is I don't want the food. I don't want to wait. I don't have time to wait on the food again. Okay. Okay, so so now what do we do? It's either you get the food remade and you go on about your day and stop yelling at my other manager because that's no. Oh, 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 oh my god. God, he really said, oh, you're not gonna give me my refund? I'm gonna take it myself. Woo, not at the wing stop. Don't just spread wing stop like that. That's cold. Oh God, the, uh, the rage. The rage was just through the roof. It was ass thrown on my call. That's medical. Don't do that. Just take the L and leave. Goodness gracious, that was a lot. Who the f are you talking to? I'm working. You're yeah, you work here. Are you the manager? Are you the owner? <laughs> I'm the owner. Are you starting running your mouth? Because I asked her that I said we weren't done eating yet. I am literally working. I don't give a You, you fing, what do you do here? You're a cook? Wow, that is just a lot, man. Like, she has some pent up aggression. This is when the wine needs to start, or maybe the wine's actually gotten a little bit too far. You know what I mean? It's just all of it's coming out at once. I don't know what's wrong with you. Back on the ball Come over here go. right now. Please. Who owns the place? Who owns the place? We're eating here. 
All I asked the girl, I said to the girl, I said, we're still eating, we're, we're not done yet. That's all I said. And you started getting cocky and being a smart ass with me. Oh, that's not how it uh, went. Yeah, that is how it went. I, I've said this so many times on this channel and I'll never understand. You go to a place like this to chill. So chill, dude. Like, they ask you if you're done yet. You, you say no. Okay, I'm not done yet. Great, I'm gonna keep eating. Fine, we're all chilling. This is, a, this is supposed to be a good time, man. Not like this, this is too much. I have no idea what she said. Not a clue. I did not catch a single word. It sounded like a gaggle of seagulls. That's all I got. I understand that she's upset and that she can really make her voice high pitched. Other than that, I have no clue what just happened. So if somebody wants to explain that to me, please do, because I'm confused. I just heard like in Charlie Brown, like when the adults are talking and it's like wah, 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 like that's what I got. Here's this, sir. Sorry we didn't meet the standard of quality that you were hoping for today. Uh, That's the uh, business yeah. hardware store manager. Free. And we'll have your other drink out here shortly. Thank you. See, that's nice. It's a free drink. Sorry about the wait. Thank you. Y'all have a wonderful Thank you. Oh, okay. It started off nice, but then it took an L real quick. I mean, I get it. People who work at Starbucks, they have a lot of patience, but not all the patience. But like, you started off so well. It was going so well. And then it just went the slam the door route. Man, you could have just held on for just a little bit longer. Okay, they want to make an issue out of, uh, today I bought some coffee today. And all I ask these guys, everywhere I go, to, every Starbucks that I go to, they always say thank you. Okay. It's just very professional. I know it's the second time I purchased this coffee from this individual over here. Stop filming me. He 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 refused. He he refused. This is my this is my evidence. This is my evidence. Your behavior is my evidence. Your behavior is my evidence. Okay. Now 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 today I asked them why can't you say thank you? He's talking about something that happened last year. You're talking about something that happened last year. Okay. What's your name? I'm talking about something that happened today. My name is Thal. I'm gonna be completely honest with you. I wasn't paying attention to the fight because I was paying attention to the two people who work at the Starbucks. Cause I was like, oh my God, they're so cute. <laughs> I saw the one guy in the back, like leaning up against the glass. I was like, oh my God, like he's kinda cute. And then like it pans over to the other guy. I was like, oh my God, he's kinda cute. And I completely zoned out of the conversation cause it was something petty anyway. So I'm just focusing on the cute people in the video. And I'm not even gonna apologize for it. It was nice to see. I had a distraction from all the BS that was going on. All I caught was I asked them to say thank you and like they did it or something like that. That's so stupid. So I'm just gonna focus on the pretty people. What's taking so long? Come on. Uh oh. Oh, not the Facebook Live. Oh, right here, sir. I'm asking you to step outside. I'm asking you to step outside. No, you don't fix these first. So I'm gonna have to put hands on this door. Oh, oh. oh my. Come on. Come on. Come on. Don't run. Oh no. Y'all ain't gonna fix my s. I'll get mine. Oh my god. Why are you going all the extra what? Why are you doing all the extra stuff? For what? Carl Jr.? It's literally a burger, my guy. A burger. Maybe two burgers. But still, you don't have to be walking around following people saying you're gonna throw hands for a burger. It's not a big deal. You probably spent like, what, $5 on that burger? It's fine. I'm gonna pay to pay uh, Give me my money back. Give me my money back. Yes, you can, and I know you can. Give me my money back. Melissa, I'm 
gonna sit here and you're gonna give me my money. I will never understand why people get so heated over coffee. It's bean water. Bean. I don't give a f about security. Give me my money. I'm not your f I'm not your f If I don't call my son to whoop your f Go ahead. You think I want mother You think I want Give me my money back. You're trying to throw hands over a cup of bean water, whether it is hot or cold or yes or no or in or out or up or down, it's still bean water. Beans, she just loves beans. You need to fire some of these motherfuckers up in here. Oh, no. Get my right, okay? Give me my money. Give me my money. Give me my money. Give me my money. Give me my Give me my money. Did I order this? Me and you talked on the phone personally. I didn't order this. Look at this. Look at this, man. Uh -oh. What is this, man? What is this? I didn't order no crab cases. <gasps> this crab cakes. Made off of in here. Crab cakes. This ate off of, homie. I'm bad. Look at that. Man. But if you got crab cakes, why don't you just keep the crab cakes? Cause like those are kind of immaculate. I feel like you know, even though. You order what you want, obviously. If I got an order that was wrong, but had stuff in it that I liked, I would just keep it. I'd be like, you know what? This was a happy surprise. The universe gave me a gift. I'm like, I'm, I'm gonna keep it. So at least we know that I would not pull a Karen if I got my order wrong. You're welcome, service people. So they don't want to walk now because they want to be entitled motherfuckers, including this black right here that wants to no, no. Yo, the fact that she was calling them entitled and then pulling that like. I could do whatever I want, like blah blah blah. No, I have every right to step. I don't have the kitchen. Then guess what? I have every right to step into the kitchen no. without you touching me. No, you don't. That's the neat thing. You don't. That's the best Nobody part of the military. No, 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 because I'm in the military. Like, first off, I have no idea about like military rules. Like, I don't know if that is a rule. So if that is a rule, like, okay, I have no idea about that. But like. This is just a lot, dude, and like we do not need to approach this situation like that. Like all of what you just said, ridiculous. On first of all, y'all supposed to make sure the customer happy. Okay. We shouldn't have to okay. go through no hassle because y'all misunderstood. Okay, sir. Well, if you paid a dollar twenty-eight. Okay. Million, okay. So she, she made that mother mistake. Money I money know, money. but the I asked for. Get this. Get this. Get this. Don't you want this? Get that. Don't have no attitude with me. Oh, oh, you you supposed to you supposed to be? Man, I call customer service. Give me the here. Cause I'm about to slay this mother barbecue sauce on your mother ass. Whoa. Give me the name of the coffee. I want the name of the coffee. Um, I asked you to give me. Whoa, big mad at Burger King. What was it over? Like chicken nuggets or something? Like, God. Just get the nuggets, just get the nuggets out of Don't you want this? Just get the nuggets. <laughs> if you get your order wrong, it's not a big deal. Okay, I can understand if you're in a hurry. Like, yeah, it's gonna be a little inconvenient, but you will survive. It's just, you got a, a happy <laughs> accident meal instead of a happy meal. That was a horrible joke. I'm so sorry. That, yeah, that was not one of my best. I apologize. Again, I know exactly what they're fighting over, but I'm not gonna talk about that. I'm gonna talk about the cute little dog, okay? Because that's what I was focusing on. He's just so fluffy and cute, and I just wanted to scoop him up and take him home with me. That's what matters to me here. Thank you. Have a good one. 
I don't care about the debate that's going on. So, dog, dog content. I, whoa, I really hope that one day on this channel, you just get to react to dogs. I would pay to do that. I wanna to react to dogs. Give me something positive. Give me the puppers or the kiggies or something. Just animals. No more, none of this. No debates over hot bean water. Okay, whoo. I need to go and drink Red Bull because I don't have any bean water today because I forgot to make it ahead of time and I'm not going to Starbucks. I just paid for my food. No, oh my you don't get no food. If you <laughs> look at all how fast the cars are going through and then look how well long I waited. Okay, you can suck my and oh. then we'll talk later. I paid for food. And I paid for food. I paid for food, yeah? Oh my god. you when you just broke their entire store hmm they can't remake your order they can't give you your order they can't give you your refund because you just pushed everything to the floor and now they've got all this other stuff going on you literally just screwed yourself over in that one you should have thought ahead you should have taken that breather that I keep telling y'all to take <laughs> 